Hi, welcome back to my channel. My name is Hadasa. In this video, I want to show you my favorite dresses and jumpsuits for this summer. Now, I do have more favorites in my closet. However, I want to show you the three pieces that I love so much and I will share with you how I style each of them as well. I will create nine outfits from these three pieces. I hope you'll enjoy the video and be inspired by the pieces. For my first piece, I have this beautiful goddess romantic dress from Zara. When I first saw this dress, I was obsessed with the embroidered detail. It is stunning. Oh my gosh, it's so feminine. It is classy. Like everything about this dress was screaming my name. So I had to get it. A little confession, my initial thought was this dress would not look good on me because I am a petite person. So with the length of this dress, I thought maybe it would look like a pajama on me. So I'm glad I took a chance on it because I fell in love with it when I tried it on. I feel like it's a combination of everything. It is lightweight, soft, and a bit stretchy as well. When touching this fabric, I feel like I'm touching a cloud. It's so soft, it's so plush. Also, when looking up close on the fabric, it looks like it's in great quality, looks expensive. It does not look cheap at all, which is wonderful. The first option to style this dress is to simply wear it on its own without anything extra but just a simple gold jewelry with some beige and cream sneakers from Kohan. I have this lovely cream clutch that I will be pairing with this dress and then that pretty much complete the outfit. It is simple, it is understated, and yet romantic. Um, this outfit is comfortable to wear around the house and also comfortable to wear in public as well, especially with the sneakers. I love this style because if I am going out to eat with some friends, I don't have to worry about my belly showing just because the fabric is loose enough where I could eat as much food as I want and don't have to feel like I have to be careful. So that is a plus for me. This next outfit, oh my gosh. I am in love because I love some red in my life. It is romantic. It is sexy in a good way sexy. It's, oh, I love, love it. There was a season in my life where I had lots of red. I definitely love that season of my life. Um, however, I did face out of that red season to where I am right now. My love of red brought me to this style. I have this beautiful angle strap heels from Nordstrom. The purse, I got it in Venice, Italy during my travel there. So definitely a great memory. To finish this outfit with some spiciness to it, I'm adding this beautiful statement belt. This whole look is romantic. Oh my gosh, I love it so much. I can definitely wear this outfit to a lot of places. Option one, I would wear it to work because I work from home, so no problem for that. And I can also wear this to hanging out with friends as well, and especially for date night. So definitely a great piece to wear. For this last outfit with this dress, I want to create a work appropriate attire going into the office. I'm going to pair it with brown meals from Sam Adaman, still keeping the statement built and finishing it off with this beautiful gold yellow tweed blazer from J. Crew. And also in terms of purse, I wanted to keep it subtle, so I'm pairing it with this beautiful Pauline bag. I love this blazer. 
this blazer is everything I'm looking for. It is lightweight, perfect for the spring and summer, beautiful statement piece. It instantly elevates my outfit and makes me look beautiful, elegant, and chic. I could see myself wearing this blazer for over five years because it's not going out of style. It is timeless, it is chic, it's a beautiful statement piece that goes with a lot of my outfits. This next piece, I have this beautiful green and white Gangnam jumpsuit from J. Crew. If you have been watching my videos, you probably have guessed it that I love J. Crew. J. Crew is pricey for my budget so i rarely shop anything full price there unless i am obsessed with the piece i do have a love and hate relationship with jumpsuit i love it so much because it's a one piece style it is easy to get dressed however the bathroom part is my least favorite i hated going to the bathroom with jumpsuit now since that information is out of the way let's talk about styling this jumpsuit for the first outfit as usual i'm keeping it simple dressing as is nothing extra so i'm pairing this jumpsuit with this lovely pecan brown sandals from kohan wearing it with simple gold jewelry and also finishing it off with this beautiful cream clutch this outfit is cute vibrant and chic i love the bow certainly makes a statement piece on the jumpsuit for the next outfit i want to create a work-friendly environment attire I am pairing this jumpsuit with this beautiful yellow gold blazer, a Pauline bag, brown mules, and a simple gold jewelry. This outfit is definitely colorful, but a pleasing to the eyes colorful. It's a beautiful color combination of the yellow, white, and green. And definitely a spring and summer look. Depending on the environment you work in, this outfit is definitely a work-friendly attire. I know I won't be toasty in this outfit in the office. For one, I always get cold in the office because the AC is so low. So I always bring an extra cardigan, an extra blazer to keep me all in good condition throughout the day. This outfit can certainly transition from the office vibe to the hangout vibe with just a small change on the blazer. For the final look with this jumpsuit, I want to create a chic casual vibe. So I am pairing this oatmeal color cardigan from Mango and finishing it off with cream sneakers from Kohan, this lovely Pauline bag, and completing it with, the, with some simple gold jewelry. With this outfit, I can certainly wear around the house because the cardigan makes it look loungy, comfy, and then the wide leg makes it very chic and comfortable. This last piece I have is a Nicole Miller maxi dress. I was in TJ Maxx. I was just looking for white dresses at the time since I am obsessed with white colors. What drawn me to this dress is that it is a linen blend. Um, I have a lot of pieces in my closet where I steam a lot. So having some pieces that don't always wrinkle it really helps to be honest the neckline is a bit too low for me so i'll have to be very careful when wearing this dress um, now i do have several camis i can wear under now let's go ahead and style this dress for the first outfit i'm just keeping it simple by pairing it with this beautiful floral sliders from sam adamant finishing it off with blush tone leather purse and some simple gold jewelry this outfit is chic relaxed and comfy um, this would be my everyday outfit i can wear around the house i can meet up with friends 
and I actually sometimes do dress up when I walk in the park. I don't see the point of wearing active wears where I'm not doing any exercise but simply just walking around the park. For the second outfit, I'm adding this animal print build as a statement piece and also a little bit of a flirty vibe. I believe I got this belt from J. Crew when they had their sales, like summer sales maybe, and I absolutely love it. It is extremely comfortable and so versatile and goes well with a lot of the palette that I have in my closet. So definitely a beautiful statement piece to add on to my wardrobe when I want to spice things up. Along with the belt, I'm wearing brown mules, cream clutch, and then finishing it off with simple gold jewelry. This belt really wears the look. It's so fun, it's so flirty, and at the same time, it's simple. I believe small, simple pieces can be beautiful in an outfit. It doesn't have to be extravagant in order to draw the attention. Last but not least, this next outfit is extremely relaxed, kind of loose, understated vibe. I am pairing this dress with this lovely lightweight silk shirt from Joie, which is a French word for joy. And I'm tucking this shirt in with this casual leather belt from Madewell, finishing it off with black espadrille from Colhan, and keeping that simple gold jewelry. And for purse, I'm wearing this black bag from Mango. This style is relaxed, comfortable, and yet still have that chic vibe. That concludes my video for today. Thank you so much for watching through this process. I hope you enjoyed the video and have found one of the pieces your favorite. I would love to hear from you in the comment below if you like any of the pieces that I have shown you. As always, it has been a pleasure of mine to share this content with you. I hope to see you again next week. Um, in the meantime, have a great day. Bye-bye.